often called the Rome of Portugal, Braga is one of the country's major spiritual centers. In this video, we're taking you on a walk through the charms of Braga, Portugal, in the hopes that you will be inspired to add this unique town to your Portugal itinerary. Even though Braga is an excellent base from where to explore northern Portugal, it can also be enjoyed on a day trip from Porto. One day in Braga is enough to check out the main sites and take in the special atmosphere of the oldest city in Portugal. The best way to get to Braga from Porto is by train. Since some of the top things to see in Braga are situated in uphill locations, we'd recommend starting your day in Braga with those. Take an Uber from the train station to the sanctuary of Our Lady of Sameiro, the highest point on this walk across Braga, and then continue your downhill stroll to all the other points of interest in the city. The sanctuary of Our Lady of Sameiro boasts a prime location atop a hill of the same name, offering breathtaking views as far as the eye can see. While there, you can visit the church in the crypt and marvel at the grand staircase. From the sanctuary of Our Lady of Sameiro, a picturesque path through nature takes you to the ultimate highlight of Braga, the magnificent sanctuary of Bom Jesus do Monte. The UNESCO-listed sanctuary of Bom Jesus do Monte in Braga is mostly known for its iconic monumental staircase. This baroque masterpiece is adorned by statues and fountains, featuring jaw-dropping views at every turn. The staircase is crowned by a beautiful church, surrounded by lush gardens and a peaceful park. Pilgrims would climb to the top of the hill via this gorgeous staircase. However, if you follow our route, you will walk down the steps instead. Another way to reach or leave the sanctuary is the Bom Jesus do Monte funicular. Dating back to the 19th century, this funicular is the oldest in the world that uses a water counterbalancing system. Whether you choose to walk down the staircase or take the funicular, you will end up at the same spot the bus stop from where you will catch the bus to the heart of Braga to continue your walk. Your first stop in downtown Braga should be Centesima Pagina, a lovely bookshop housed in Casa Rolao, a stunning building designed by the famous local architect Andres Soares. A few steps from the quaint bookstore, the vibrant Praça da Repubblica awaits. Dating back to the Middle Ages, Braga's main square is buzzing with life all day long. On your way to the Cathedral of Braga, stop at the charming Santa Barbara Garden, an oasis of vivid colors and flower scents that interrupt the urban landscape. It is often said that the Cathedral of Braga is even older than Portugal itself. For that alone, it's well worth a visit while you are in Braga. Apart from its grand exterior, once inside the cathedral complex, you can admire the church, its adjoining chapels and the high choir. The latter, with its painted ceilings and impressive woodwork, is considered one of the world's prettiest. You can see it on a guided tour only, with a separate ticket you can buy on site. The Holy Cross or Santa Cruz Church is yet another religious site worth checking out on your way to the ornate Rayo Palace. Built by Andres Soares as a residential mansion, the Palacio de Rayo stands out for its splendid architecture and quintessentially Portuguese azulejos, the country's typical painted tiles. End your walk through Braga with a quick stop at Café Brasileira, an emblematic cafe that dates back to 1907, before you make your way to the Arco da Porta Nova. This triumphal arch used to be the western gate to the city of Braga in the Middle Ages. One of the most iconic symbols of Braga, the Arco da Porta Nova, is where you will be saying your goodbyes to the ravishing Rome of Portugal. No matter its compact size, 
Braga is a city of many charms that can keep you busy and happy for as many days as you have to spare. If you're short on time though, watching this video is all you need to plan the perfect day trip to Braga from Porto. Alternatively, you can visit Braga on a guided tour from Porto by clicking on any of the recommended day trips we've included in the description below. If you enjoyed our video about Braga, Portugal, please like, comment and share it. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.